there, it's Heather with Create Again. In this video, I'm going to show you how I created this um, African elephant bull in fluid art. It's a controlled acrylic pour painting. And a few things that you want to keep in mind if you want to create a subject in this style is, first, um, you must work quickly um, so that your paint will not dry. And you want it to be malleable and fluid the whole time. Uh, secondly, if you choose your subject from a painting, make sure that you have written consent from the photographer. Um, this elephant was referenced from an amazing photographer that I'll link below. Um, you can also purchase his photo there. If you find an image that you really like and you want to paint um, and you don't get written consent uh, from the author or photographer. Um, there are other sites that you can reference without copyright infringement, like Pixabay and Unsplash. So here I'm just sketching out or painting out the outline of the elephant with a paintbrush. Um, as you will see, I'll use many tools to spread and swipe. Um, and paint with, I, I use things like paint sticks and mostly palette knives. I pour directly from the cup or dripped from the tools depending on how much color I want in each area. I spread to achieve shadowing and to show texture. For this, I used um, silicone only in the silver metallic paint. And also initially I had a background painted, you could see that blue, but later I painted over it. Um, I just didn't, didn't really like it. Um, but you could also do this over a previous pour uh, for an interesting background. That would be fun. Uh, so just keep in mind that sometimes you mess up and that's okay. I, this control pour took me technique took me quite a while um, and I'm still finding what works for me. Yeah, so see here you can just see I'm dripping over and then I'll spread with my palette knife um, just to kind of get the areas of shadowing and texture. Uh, I used all of these paints are italics. I used a like an espresso, um, very pretty brown metallic, um, a rose gold, and of course this silver. Um, and I used some just regular gold uh, metallic and white and black, of course. This video is sped up about eight times. Um, so although you got to work quickly, I mean, it does take a while, um, but it, it stays wet for, for, well, it took me a few hours, but I worked in sections, so that'll help. And you can always start small, and if you don't like it, scrape it off and try again. That's what I do quite often. Okay, so I'm going to let you enjoy the video without my um, crazy accent. So you can enjoy the rest of this and I uh, will talk to you again at the end of the video.
If you have found this video helpful, please subscribe and like. And if you have forgotten your love of art, please check out my website, createagain.com, for more reasons to create again. <music>